Who I got here? What's your name? Uh, Skat. Skat? Yeah. Daniel. Daniel. Nice to meet you. Now you here with, with who? Chicago Rocket Riders. Now tell us what that is. Tell us who that uh, is. Chicago Rocket Riders is a three-wheel riding club out of Chicago, Illinois. Chicago Rocket Riders is a three-wheel riding club out of Chicago, Illinois. We were founded in 2019. Um... Right now, we're 84 members deep. We came down to Wisconsin to meet up with this company called Show Chrome. Nice. Uh, big bike part distributor. They in, recently got in the Can-Am market, the Spider market, stuff of that nature. So we linked up with those guys, went to their facility for a tour, uh, barbecue, gift bags, the whole nine. Man, this is what I want you to do for me, because you speak very well. Mm-hmm. I done ran into a couple of y'all. Y'all educated. Okay. Got great jobs. Yes, sir. Do me a favor and dispel a couple of misconceptions that come with a riders club what do people normally think but what are you guys so a lot of people think that we're just not we're but majority of clubs riding clubs mc clubs all the other stuff hoodlums thugs out there just wilding out but we're not like that we are a family we're a tight-knit community we are we do give backs we do community service we do the whole nine yard we have a Full uh, incorporation, non for profit. We do it all. Nice. Yeah. So it's it's we show and prove every day. Nice. Eighty four members strong and grown. Eighty four this year. We've had over three hundred seventy four when we first started. Nice. But just like any company, you grow and then you downsize because cream rise to the top. But it takes a level of commitment too. Exactly. And everybody doesn't have that level of commitment. Yes. And there's no knock against anybody like that. But that's right. Hey, with a strong, I rather have a strong eighty four. Than a, than a subpar 300. Yeah. Everybody heard me say it. 10 lions versus 100 sheep. Most deaf. So, Man, that's a great saying, man. All right. So I got a little rapid fire for you. All right. Gotcha. All right. So you preparing to fit? What are you going to choose? Fit accessories or cologne? So I'm preparing to fit. I'm going to choose accessories because the cologne is already there regardless. But the accessories. Okay. Prepare a gourmet meal for your lady or a styling outfit for her? Meal. She'd prefer the time versus the outfit. Ooh, nice. I like that. Watch a good movie or listen to a good album? <sighs> movie. Movie for me. Movie. movie for me. All right. Biggest turn off, bad breath or body odor? <laughs> Both. <laughs> Both. <laughs> but you know what? Let's, let's, depends on how we got that body odor. Okay. Maybe we worked it up. But other than that, so I guess <laughs> I guess I'm about to say that bad breath. We're bad, keep it breath. Off bad breath. All right, all right. Advice or research? I say research. Research? Research, because you can formulate your own opinion once you get to research and do it. If you get advice, you're just getting somebody else's opinion on what they think, what they feel. Mm -hmm. And it's not necessarily informed. It's just their assumption of how they feel about it. Okay. What's something that you had to unlearn in your adulthood? (sighs) Listen to hear instead of respond. You know, I had to unlearn the whole not listening. You know what I'm saying? You know how you just, what you say? Yeah, blah, 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 whatever. You already know what you're saying. Right. So I had to unlearn that part of it to be able to be open to receive what people were saying. Nice. And then make a uh, comment on it or stuff of that nature. That's tough. Self-awareness or self-confidence? I'm cocky, so confidence. Confident. All right. It ain't cocky, it's confidence. Pretty much. All right. Education or experience? Experience. You could be, it's a lot of smart dummies out there. It's a lot of smart dummies out there. Yeah. Experience. All right. One of your fondest childhood memories? Where y'all from? St. Louis. Y'all ever play a game called It? Hide and go seek, something like that? Yeah. Yeah. Basic stuff. Those are the child fondest memories right there. Those games right there. I you, me, and some space myself. and some friends. All that. Most of. Yep. All right. What's the characteristic you highly value in others? Honesty. Honesty. Mm-hmm. Integrity. <sighs> I'm just going to leave it at those two. We're going right. to keep it simple. All right. That's it. That's it. Get connected. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Appreciate, Appreciate you, bro. Y'all. Yep. I dropped in on the podcast. Let's go. <laughs>